do you get many patients in with um, alligator injuries? <laughs> Actually, it's interesting. It, the the truth is no, uh, we don't. Um, and yeah. I, everyone knows I, about the danger, do they? Yeah, it was funny. I only yeah. seen well one time actually. I, an alligator got into our hospital, and uh, and everyone there, the Cajuns who I work with, they just grabbed it. They just grabbed it, <laughs> taped up its mouth. The nurses were uh, were treating its wound, hit some wounds on its leg. They treated the nurses treated the wounds, and they let the alligator. I've actually go back seen out. that in Cambodia. Did they just grab it, tape it up, and take it away? Yeah, and then but <laughs> I I've seen one really one. Oh no, I've seen two. I've seen two alligator like legit alligator injuries over yeah. five years and one was uh one was in the, a guy who, i think it sort of explains that it. it's a, a guy who was uh surveying the the land for some company like doing some for a corporation he was surveying a land and uh and he was like yeah so i was there and, and uh doing it in this area and like the patient behind the screen next door he's like he's like oh you 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 were you were there during nesting season. Everyone knows not to go down the swamp during nesting season. I was like, wait, everyone knows that? And I walk outside of the room. I was yeah, like, yeah. I go to the secretary. I was, like, I was like, hey, can you go to the swamps right now? She's like, no, it's nesting season. Like, you, everyone knows you can't go. I was like, oh, everyone, I guess, does know that don't go there during nesting season. That's when the alligators get a little violent. And but coming so from people, New York, it wasn't too big of a, it wasn't a common problem. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we didn't have them in New York. Mm. Even maybe in the, in the in the sewer systems, but I don't. I've never seen any. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, yes, yeah, so do, do you get do you get a lot of snake bites? Yes, but they're not they're not particularly like they're. We do have poisonous snakes in Louisiana, but well, it's, it's a swamp, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, we do, but they're generally not. They're not. Uh, they're not terribly poisonous. They're not like uh, in. There are certain regions where where it's a uh, much more extreme. Our right, our okay. our swamps actually pretty. It's pretty friendly. <laughs> the people there love it. They love it. They, you know, they make a lot of great food out of that swamp. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And, uh, yeah, they, they, they really, uh, they really do enjoy the, the area. And, uh, it's beautiful, actually. It's funny. The swamp is thought of like a gross place, but, uh, sort of like a rainforest. Um, yeah. we used to call a rainforest the jungle, and it was a terrible, gross place. And then it got a cool name, rain, magical rainforest. Yeah. And now everyone thinks it's beautiful. The swamp's similar. Like a rainforest, you don't want to go, like, live. Like, it, like maybe you could set a tent up there for a little bit, but mm. it's not like being in a nice mountain forest, like like you know dry forest. Like you're gonna you're gonna end up with like bug bites the size of your head, and like it's like it's kind of rough, but there's a beauty to it a, as well. And um and the swamp is I think a it is a similar it has a similar uh, ma magic that like a a rainforest does. Yeah. All part of the created order. Yeah. yeah. Great, Doctor Freeman. Thank you so much. And uh, anytime yeah. you got more work to tell us or any ideas you, you're always welcome of course um, yeah my pleasure I'll, fascinating fascinating as always i'll give you a ring you know <laughs> please do please do okay thank you pleasure thank you